What are you doing? I am cleaning out the sump. This sump, by the way, comes from the shower in the sink. Haley's shower in her sink. And also the sink at the bar. They all come in here. Then this hose was looking a little kinky. You have to put it down because the light from your flashlight. <laughs> yeah, I bet. That was probably pretty bright. Yeah, it was just kinky. So I'm really going kinky. to uh, replace this smelly thing with something a little bit more soft and Look supple. Look at that gross. Mm -hmm. It's all over it. Yep. So it why do you gross. clean the bilge? Why am I cleaning and vacuuming the bilge? Yeah. How often do you do it? And uh, why are you doing it? Infrequently as I can get away with, but... <laughs> <laughs> when it starts to look a little bit slimy and there's sediment sloshing back and forth in it, then it's time to pump it. Yeah, it's a little stinky. The water from the showers... Yes, goes into the sump. Goes sump. into the sump. And then what? Then it gets pumped overboard. Overboard. There's a float switch. Right. Fills up. Float switch. Pump, pumps it out. Float switch goes back down. Shuts off. Just cycles and cycles. Right. So how many bilges do you have on board? Four. So you just clean the one in the engine room, which is behind us. Well, behind you. Build, well, it's all one big ass bilge with four pumps and multiple compartments. I vacuum all the bilge spaces in the engine room. And then I vacuum this space. And then we go in the hole and we vacuum out the whole space forward and then <laughs> and then we go underneath Haley's bed and we vacuum out the space around the bow thruster and then we go back to the master stateroom and vacuum that bilge and then I go into the lazarette in the cockpit and vacuum that bilge it's a ton of fun are you doing all of that today yes 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 I am so we were, we're reenacting Reenacting. Look at that beautiful unkinked pipe. Look at that flow. Oh yeah, it's full flow. Full flow. Okay, so this is what Mark is calling the hole. So we're in Haley's room, and this door. And actually, I'm gonna probably do in front of up by Haley's bed first. Okay, well the hole is open. All right, so that's the hole, and then we gotta take Haley's bed apart and get under there first. Yeah, I'll do that first. All right, so what, you're sticking the vacuum down there? Underneath that other thing that you have to lift up? Mm-hmm. Okay. That's the plan. A lot of water down there. There's, oh, because it rained. And because all the water goes forward and this area underneath the bow thruster is forward and deeper than the forwardmost bilge pump. So it always holds water. Okay. Good times. Right, we got quite a bit of rain from that storm that I keep sticking my thumb into the camera, sorry. Um, that storm that we went to bed thinking 50 mile an hour winds and we ended up with 80 to 100 mile an hour winds. That was fun. Yeah, we got a lot of rain that day. So there's the bow thruster motor and you can see all the water down there. It's a lot. It's like five, seven, ten gallons. Hopefully my trusty little shop bag can still pull water up that high. <laughs> Struggling. One. Well, that makes that noise when the shop vac is full. There is probably an easier way to do this. It would require a water pump, which I have. Shopback Corporation, Williamsport, Pennsylvania. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come 
going down the hole. Down the hole. Okay, this is the hole. I have the inverter, thruster battery, storage, a little bit of water on that side. There's the house batteries, wastewater tank forward, thruster battery, more storage, a little more water in there, forward most bilge, a little bit of water in there. This is the pump room, two of our toilet head pumps. And then back there is the raw water pump for the anchor chain wash down. That beautiful noise that says it's full. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a beauty. Yep. Okay, so I just wanted to wrap up the bilge pump video. We are here in the master stateroom. This is where the other sump pump is that he would be taking care of and vacuuming any water out and he takes that plastic cover off and he cleans out up anything that is in there. Okay, so this is the cockpit and this is the lazarette door and that's where he would go whenever you hear him mention the lazarette. So we're in the cockpit of Valkyrie and it's just underneath that door. And right here, these are the three counters. So he checks these every day. And if it's anything other than zero, he knows that there's water and he goes ahead and takes care of that sure if you've watched other videos on somewhere on the water on our YouTube page and read any of our blogs on alongsidecreations.com somewhere on the water you will have heard us commenting on these counters and whenever he looks at them he puts on his trusty little headlamp and off we go looking for the source of the water so anyway, thank you for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe button, thumbs up. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment and we'll get right back to you. Thank you.